100 days since the U.S. Supreme Court overturned Roe v. Wade, an abortion became illegal in Missouri. New at 6, our Missouri Chief Capitol Bureau reporter Emily Manley is live with what Planned Parenthood is doing to reduce how far women have to travel for reproductive health care. Emily. Well, Jasmine, later this year, Planned Parenthood of the St. Louis region in southwest Missouri will have an abortion clinic, but it will be on wheels. This comes after abortion became illegal in a handful of states earlier this year. It will travel closer to neighboring states where abortion is not allowed. Patients coming to our Fairview Heights Health Center from outside Missouri and Illinois have increased by more than 340%. Planned Parenthood's location in Illinois has wait times of two weeks or more, which is why the provider is going mobile. We purchased a set 37 foot um, RV that it's been retrofitted um, to create a patient experience similar to that that one will experience when they're coming for medication abortion at one of our health centers. The unit will have a waiting room, a standard lab and two exam rooms. At first, only medication abortion will be offered. We do have plans um, in likely the first quarter of the next calendar year to think about how we can expand to first trimester procedural abortion. And in the coming weeks, Planned Parenthood is also opening a location in Rala to offer things like birth control. The Rala Health Center will bring vasectomy services and other health care for men too. Republican Representative Mary Elizabeth Coleman co-sponsored the 2019 trigger ban legislation that does not allow exemptions for rape or incest survivors. In a statement Monday, she said, this is a desperate move from those that profit from women in crisis. I want every woman in Missouri who is considering abortion to know that Missouri stands ready to help her and her baby. Last year, Coleman proposed to make it illegal to help a Missourian get an abortion, even if it's in a different state. She's now running for state Senate and says she's still evaluating what bill she would file next session. Well, we are preparing for another legislative session where we will see continued attacks to reproductive freedom and, and birth control. Now, Planned Parenthood says they hope to have this mobile clinic up and running by the end of the year, but they're still figuring out the best routes. They did say today that they are planning on the clinic to be located in southern Illinois and it will run along the border of Missouri and Illinois. Reporting live tonight from Missouri State Capitol Bureau in Jefferson City, I'm Emily Manley, Fox 2 News.